Hi, my name is Mark Cantrell. I'm an Applications Engineer with the iCoupler Group here at Analog Devices. I'm here today to introduce a new solution to a problem that has limited the acceptance of the universal serial bus in the industrial and medical markets. These types of applications have strict isolation requirements uh, for electrical connections to patients or dangerous machines. However, there's also a lot of pressure to take advantage of low-cost computer hardware. In the PC world, the USB bus is the bus of choice. It's self-configuring, hot-swappable, and nearly universally available. But it is not easy to isolate. It combines differential signals, single-ended signals, as well as passive states, and all of these signals are bidirectional. You can isolate USB in one of two ways. First, if you have flexibility in your design, you can pull the USB function out of the controller and isolate the serial interface you've created, such as SPI or even RS-232. This requires lots of components, including a serial interface engine and isolators, and adds extra layers of programming to your project. Another way is to utilize an off-the-shelf USB isolation module. These are grossly expensive, but they simply plug into your existing D plus and D minus lines. They are also large and can't be integrated into a system. They're not a realistic production scale solution. Analog Devices has a third option. We've developed a new product based on our iCoupler technology that combines the ease of use of the off-the-shelf module with the integration capability of the standalone serial interface engine. The ADUM4160 is an integrated single-chip USB isolator. It's designed to provide isolation in the D plus D minus lines, so it works with existing USB ports. Using this product is as easy as providing enough board space to place a 16-lead SOIC package and routing the D plus and D minus lines through the chip. When it's used as an integral part of a peripheral, the peripheral can still be certified through USB IF the implementers forum as a fully compliant USB device. It can also be used to create an isolated host port or even an isolated cable. Our features include support for low and full speed operation, that's one and a half megabits and 12 megabits per second. It automatically handles high speed devices properly, even though it doesn't support the high speed data rate of 480 megabits per second. It has high ESD tolerance, 5,000 volt RMS medical isolation under IEC 60601. We provide for control of the upstream pull-up from the peripheral, allowing controlled enumeration. Flexible power inputs support 3.3 or 5 volt supplies. No drivers are required, and it's completely transparent to the USB traffic. By the way, in many applications you'll also need to isolate the power from the host to the peripheral. We also offer the ADUM5000, which uses our ISOPower technology to deliver up to one half watt of isolated, regulated power. It is the same size as the ADUM4160, so you can use it to create a complete USB isolation solution in a very small area. For example, here we have our evaluation board hooked up with a USB mouse. As you can see, we have the ADUM. 4160 as well as the ADUM5000 providing power. On the scope screen you can see bus traffic as I move the mouse. We think that the ADUM4160 will finally provide the ease of design, performance, and low cost that will allow USB to take its place in the industrial and medical markets. For more information please visit our website for a wide variety of support materials. Thank you very much.